In the next four minutes, I'm going to show you four smokes and some additional utility that will help you take the B site of Mirage. Let's get into it. Hi everyone, welcome to the Chew Matrix channel. If you're new here, then I upload tutorials like this one and my own matchmaking experiences with a minimum of one video every single week at the moment. So if you find this useful, then definitely consider subscribing. If you want to learn some other smokes on this map, then check out my video on the A site smokes, which are even easier than these ones to learn. The simplest smoke I have for you today is an arch smoke that you can throw from the back alley. Just line yourself up on the right side of this window, look up and you want to aim between this stick and the corner of this ledge. With your crosshair in the middle, just throw the grenade while standing still. And this will smoke off the arch to help your push. Unless you smoke short as well, then remember to be careful of this position. The other three smokes we're learning today will require a jump throw keybind. If you don't have one already, then I'll leave the command to create one in the description below for you. If a tutorial on jump throw binds would be useful, then let me know down below and I can definitely look at making one. Next up, we have the kitchen window smoke. We're going to get into this corner of the back alley and aim at this top corner of the tower. And simply jump throw the smoke. As you can see, this will land perfectly in the window, blocking off all vision in and out of the kitchen. You can combine this smoke with a simple flash to get an extra bit of help for the push. Just aim near the top of the apartments as you run in and jump through while you run. This one doesn't need to be precise, so don't worry about lining up perfectly or using a jump bind. The flash will blind the opponents in a variety of positions on the site. And of course kitchen would have been smoked off if you threw the smoke first. We can also pair the window smoke with one to kitchen door. Just line up on the centre of this doorway, aim at this lip on the side of the tower and move your crosshair slightly to the right then jump through the smoke. It's going to pop just to the right of the doorway and cover off the choke point. When both of the kitchen smokes are thrown together, the CTs will not be able to get into the site at all easily with the main rotation points both obscured. We can also combine these kitchen smokes with the arch smoke we learned earlier, which will give our team a real advantage. The final smoke for today is a short smoke. Just get into this corner of the back alley and we will look halfway between the wire and the edge of this building, which makes a triangle. Line up horizontally with the spot where the wire meets the building, and then perform a jump throw. Short is now blocked off, helping you to take the site. Combining this short smoke with the kitchen smokes is also very powerful, and you could also use the arch smoke at the same time since all of these lineups are thrown from different positions. To help us get into the site, here's a nice pop flash. This one can be a bit tricky at first, so it's good to have a few practices offline. Just head into this corner of the apartment, line up your crosshair with the top of the door, and then aim in the middle of the wall panel we can see to the left. Then we run forward and throw before we hit the wall in front of us and then it will blind the CTs in these positions really, really well. Finally, we have a Molotov that we can throw to the van position, meaning we don't have to check it as we're pushing. Just aim at this cross to the right of the van, then running forwards, release the grenade before you get to the stairs. As you can see, it completely pushes any opponents out of the van spot. The van molly can also be used in conjunction with one of our smokes and a pop flash. Don't forget to get a bit creative when combining the different grenades as they're most effective when combined. And remember, if you're in a game and you or your teammates can't remember the smokes you need, then you can just take a time out and send them this video to gain an advantage in the match. And that's it for attacking B-Site Mirage from the apartments. Be sure to check back soon, I'll have my video on the mid smokes out. Also check out my 3 minute basic A smokes if you need help on that side of the map. Thanks a lot for watching guys, it really means a lot that I've been getting such great feedback after a small number of videos and it's making me want to keep improving. I'll see you next time, bye bye.